Hello, um, this video, well, audio thing is a bit different. So I did a video on the brilliant Shane Meadows film, This Is England, and I love that film. I love the whole series. It's unique, the Britishness. And copyright. Copyright, copyright, copyright. The funny thing is, this video falls within fair use. It is transformative, it is a review, I've edited, I've put filters over the footage, it is completely different, and I've not used a single audio from the film either. And I'm frustrated by this, because I've put the appeal in, but nothing's happened, and I've had to put the video on Odyssey and other platforms, which are linked down below. I'm going to put a big link in the comments if you guys want to watch it as well, so it's in the doobly-doo in the comments. But this brings up case in point. Lately, over the last few weeks, I've experienced a lot of weird copyright claims from Chinese companies, from Russian companies, from companies in Asian countries, India and places like that, that have nothing to do with it. And I want to say this, YouTube's copyright system is broken as hell. It is completely broken and it's frustrating because it doesn't work. It's bot driven, It anyone can file a copyright claim. And I'm kind of sick of it at this point. So video has been put onto other platforms just for the sheer, you know, you can find it there. But I've had this so many times in the last few years and they always tend to be fake companies, um, a lot, like I said, Chinese and Russian and Indian, usually, and it, that's what I. It just it seems so ridiculous that there's no humans looking at this problem. And the things that are getting copyrighted are nothing to do with anything that I'm talking about. Media clips, whatever. What is getting copyrighted is pictures that I've taken of myself. That's happened. Fair use music that I have exp that I use constantly gets copyrighted by companies that don't have anything to do with the music. I've even I've managed to email the companies where I get my music from, and they've been brilliant and um, got that sorted out. But it's a pain. And YouTube needs to fix this. I mean, by copyright law is out of date. How it functions, what it's done, how it's dealt with is a joke. And fair use is such a loose term for many, many, many things that it just becomes impossible. When you have robots dealing with your stuff or people dealing with it. There's no human involved. And for small YouTubers, this is very hard to fight. For small content creators, full stop, fighting these fake copyrights, these this ridiculous thing, over and over gets very old. When I first joined YouTube, I used to get a load of them then. And again, in my early videos, I didn't even have music. It was just me sitting in front of a camera. That, that's literally it, with a photo of me holding a book in a thumbnail, with no text on it. It, And I remember getting copyright claims for music, for this, for that, for a photograph, for a video footage. Anyone can file these, and the content match thing is a joke, because the amount of copyrighted stuff on YouTube that slips through the radar is amazing. Um, yet channels get penalised for something that they're do actually working correctly for. I think uh, YouTuber Lindsay Ellis brought this up in one of her videos and a few others where it becomes a constant fight and YouTube now holds the right to monetize your videos, which is a joke if you're not monetized. But this is the problem. Copyright law is out of date, and I know this is me ranting and rambling, but I'm just frustrated because I have had so many of these in the last few weeks. Um, I mean, the This Is England review was Film 4, but Film 4 don't own 
this is England. I don't even, it didn't even, going by the information on it, I don't even think it was the real Film 4. Film 4 doesn't own any rights to This Is England. It's Studio Canal and BBC Film. So, can we sort this out, YouTube? Can we deal with this? Uh, It's just, it's now to the point where I know so many people that are getting buggered by copyright law and broken copyright claims and fake copyright claims. I know someone that just killed their channel off. They just gave up because they kept getting copyright claims from India over and over and over. And it just, you give up. So this is me ranting. Copyright law sucks. My video is available on other platforms. Links in doobly-doo and comments. And YouTube, fix this mess now.